sandy pink belt here, so you guys know what that means. It's back day. A little bit higher reps, 14 to 18 on everything. Still, we're gonna be concentrating on the negative aspects, so on the way down, two to three seconds, so it's not the super slow, 1,001, 1,002. This week, three sets on most things, 14 to 18 reps. It's gonna be a, a butt kicker because we got deadlifts. Not first, we got them second. Really working the lower back there. So we're gonna start off with dumbbell bent over rows. Appreciate you guys watching these. You guys can always go see the full length video. And you know what? I don't say this to everyone. If you can't say something nice on my videos or in life, don't say anything at all. Some of you guys gotta know what being a soldier is all about. Finding the angles you look best from. And when I come in, always acknowledge the crowd first. Kind of give them a little head nod or do something that's gonna get the people kind of going. Like, okay, this guy's different, but do that and feel comfortable. Because then everyone's gonna be a little bit different. You gotta feel comfortable with what you're doing. But when I hit it, it's always feet first. So I'll, I'll come in and I'll hit this one. So the feet first thing, last thing that comes into place is the hand. And when the hands hit their place, everything. Breathe out, big smile. That's me, and then I take a couple more steps to all the judges. All right, I was just I was delaying my deadlifts there, so that's why I came in. <laughs>
for the last set today. out a little less than that still practicing things like this just because it's a good mind muscle connection anyhow I just want to leave you guys on the note that uh, competing is the goal of mine to something to strive for and push my body to I don't complete for compete for a placing or you know win or lose I'm still still me at the end of the day a lot of people are like why are you, why are you competing Steve um, just wanted to do it because it's something that I like the challenge of being able to try to push my body to be a little bit better than last year. I had a good off season, was able to gain some size. Um, and I was 240 in college. I'm about, you know, like I said, about 210 right now, 212. Um, it was nothing for me, you know, growing up in high school, benching 320, no, as 320 as a sophomore freshman. 375, 380 as a senior, I had all the size I needed. I kind of went away from that. Um, last Olympia prep and tried to play more of the conditioning game. I didn't feel outright. This last last season, I was able to I think, concentrate more on strength, working with Neil Hill, put on some good size. Now we're just going to bring it back down tight again, feel outright, be the best me I can be at the end of the day. That's all you should count on. You don't count on anyone else but yourself, the work you're willing to put in, being the best you you can be. Until next time, if you're doing a contest, practice posing. If you're not doing a contest, practice posing, mind muscle connection. It's a great thing. Just don't do it maybe in the middle of the busiest time of the gym. You might get some weird looks. Anyhow, thanks for tuning in. I'm out, Soldier Nation.